Carlos Nelson with Cascade Sports. We're here at William Christman at Casey Durick's uh, basketball clinic. Uh, we're debuting our new program on the court. And we have another parent here who has uh, two kids that are attending the clinic. And who do we have here? David Burkhart. Uh, how old are the kids that you have uh, that are attending this, this clinic today? My boys are 11 and 14. 11 and 14. How long have they been working with the 14-year-old the with Casey? Uh, they've both been working with him for a couple of years. A couple of years. Uh, could you tell us, it's my understanding that uh, both your boys are homeschool. Could you tell our audience a little bit about homeschool? Yes, it's where, you, where they do their school at home. They're, they have a complete curriculum and uh, mainly their mother uh, organizes it and they do their work each day and, and uh, usually spend uh, you know, around four hours or so doing that and that makes a lot of time for extra stuff like they do music and they do basketball. So. Uh, also, I was speaking to another athlete earlier and he was saying he was a homeschool athlete and he informed me that he played for a homeschool team. And I know a lot of our audience might not be familiar with that and said that the team, uh, I think, went was second or first in their nationals or what have you. Could you tell the audience a little bit about that? Right. There's, well, in Kansas City, there's at least uh, two or three organizations that do homeschool. The one we're with is Kansas City East Lions, and they have basketball programs for boys and girls from uh, 10 and under all the way up to high school. And uh, you know, to give you an example, you know, uh, we, we kind of go to this national competition, and one of the teams is actually the team that uh, Blake Griffin played on. Uh, Excellent. High. So uh, there's actually been some pretty good kids come out of uh, home school. You know, the Spanish girl that played, I think, in Tennessee. Uh, she came out of the homeschool program. Oh, so so they they put some real ballers in in uh, uh, Division One. Right, I and mean, we have the full gamut, but I mean we've definitely had them that have gone, you know, gone. And 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 I would think being homeschooled, your kids really understand the value of education. Right, I mean you know everybody knows they got to put the work in and and uh, and do that kind of thing, but with not having you know public school, you know you have a lot of downtime. Right. And in public school, you know, you're, you're more efficient, so you have a lot more time to practice your basketball or whatever you're doing. So, so that, it goes without saying, mom and dad are educated. That's right. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's a pleasure having you on the show. We look forward to covering your, your, your both of your boys, uh, and we'll see you next time. Okay. Very good. All right.